Okay, so let's look at some limb control drills. Our limb, moving limbs out of the way. So when we're doing our, stri our striking mesocycle, we talked about how the main thing we're looking at is the preemptive strike. You know, how's your mom? And I go for this, this strike, and this big limb is in the way. How do we get rid of this? Um, from from Pinan Shield and Kyoto, the applications of your, your um, knife on locks, clear limbs. We have two variations of it. We're left to left on the first one. Okay, I'm moving with my rear hand to clear the limb and my lead hand strikes. On the second one, I'm clearing it with the front hand, passing it to the rear hand, and again, my um, lead hand strikes. And again, we talked about that concept of um, moving towards what I know and away from what I don't know. I don't really like the inside one for obvious reasons. That's why when I cut away, when I cut an angle away from um, um, Paddy's arm there, all his weapons are facing that way and mine are facing him. So the drill is we can drill it on both sides, but really to get better at clearing limbs, Paddy just for the sake of the drill presents this hand. I can clear it from the, with my rear hand first from the outside, or I can clear it from the inside. Touch this dance again. Again from the outside or from the inside. Um, let's look at why I would use one or the other. Let's just say, I'm going to outside first. The minute I, I push this down, Paddy resists with shoulder pressure. There's no way I can push that down. Path of least resistance. If, I, if, I'm, if he's resisting that way, there's nothing to stop me moving in this way. He can't stop the bullet, if that makes sense. So as I push down to, to move in and I feel resistance, I'm on the inside. But again, I need to be careful of that hand. So I'm moving, I throw this, I just take the down straight away. We want our follow-ups. We don't just want to be doing the, the knife hand without following up. So the drill is, um, how's your mom? I, I throw my preemptive strike, this comes up. If I move to the outside and, and he resists, I'm moving to the inside and then I just take the down. Or that can work vice versa. Let's just say he presents the hand again. If I go to the inside and Paddy's resisting that, there's nothing to stopping me moving to the outside. So you want that feel factor to stop the Why we would do one to the outside or the inside. Obviously, outside's better. I'm cutting an angle away from that hand, but sometimes I have to go to the inside. And if I do, I don't just stop after the knife. So again, I'm in or I'm in. If I go for the first one and Paddy resists, I'm moving to the inside and then I'm following up with whatever you want. Or I go to the inside first, okay, and, and Paddy's resisting and I feel that, that resistance, and now I'm in. So that's our first limb clearance drill.